Greetings from Ashland, Maine, 40 miles south of the Canadian border, 20 miles west of Presque Isle, northern Maine's largest city. This location is the very point where lumber meets agriculture where spruce and fir rub shoulders with potatoes and broccoli, to the west miles of timber, and to the east acres and acres of farmland, potatoes and broccoli. Did you know that Maine has 17.6 million acres of forest, produces over 50,000 acres of potatoes, and 44 million pounds of broccoli? Did you know clicking the like button inspires YouTube to share this video with others? Now you know. Let's continue. Ashland became Ashland in 1862. However, did you know that seven years later the town leaders changed the name to Dalton after William Dalton who came here around 1830? But wait, seven years later they reverted to its historic and current name. Ashland it is. Ashland has some unique and fascinating things about it. For one thing, they have a museum that showcases Maine's historic logging industry with special focus on the difficult conditions faced by lumbermen. You can check them out on their Facebook presence. The link will be below. Also, Northeast Pellets is here in Ashland and they are a pellet manufacturer that produces 100% back free pellet. They wholesale and retail premium wood pellets for homes and businesses. Their pellets are clean burning, low ash and highly efficient. Also here in town is Resilient Solutions LLC and they provide web design and hosting services. Kevin Bushy is a lead webmaster developing functional clean and user-friendly website. He has designed both internet and intranet solutions for clients including the U.S. Marine Corps, the National Guard Bureau, and FEMA. Also here in town is the Inland Fisheries and Wildlife. They manage propagation of fish, habitat management, wildlife sanctuaries, wildlife management areas, and data collection. This is Ashland, Maine. We're glad you visited. Relax and enjoy the rest of the view of Main Street. Thanks for watching.